Thank you very much. Paul, I think that that woman is very, very strong. Yeah, unbelievable. I think she may be the strongest woman I've ever known. Unbelievably strong. Uh, you are very good on the mountain. No, right? I look like a jerk, but then... Uh, our next guest has been making and writing songs and making records and uh, everything else for more than uh, 30 years. No other artist can match his record of 53 number one hit singles. This is his uh, brand new album here. It's entitled A House on Old Lonesome Road. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Conway Twitty. <laughs> Pretty. Nice to see you. How are you doing? Come on over here. Yes, sir. <laughs> Pleasure to meet you. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Sounded great. Thank you. That's a good group. Yeah. Uh, now, let's see. I think you own a baseball team. You still own a ball team or not? Uh, a couple of minor league baseball teams. Which ones? Uh, one of them is the Nashville Sounds in Nashville, Tennessee. What uh, league is that in? Is that a... Uh... Uh, that's a farm club for Cincinnati Reds. Uh -huh. It's a triple-A AAA team? Yeah. Triple-A. High minors? Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. How did they? How were they? Uh, how did they do last year? Not too good. Really? Not too good. But yeah. we had some good years and had some bad years, just like everybody else. Yeah. And then we have a team down in Huntsville, Alabama. Uh, Conseco played there a couple mm -hmm. of years ago. You must have a lot of money. 
No. <laughs> well, I mean, you're you a lot of baseball two, teams. Two baseball teams. No. Uh, and your name is actually Conway Twitty? No, that's a, that's a stage name. Mm -hmm. uh, I got that name from the map of the United States back in 1957. Mm -hmm. Real name's Harold Jenkins. Mm -hmm. but, uh, well, Harold Jenkins would be great, too. Yeah, that's a good name. Yeah. Uh, but, you know, I, I thought, you know, disc jockeys back in the 50s got so many records. Every week they'd get 50, 60 new records mm -hmm. in the end. And uh, they had to decide what they were going to play and what they weren't going to play. And I thought, well, maybe with an interesting name like Elvis Presley or something right. like that, they might play it. And once they do, you're on your own. So I started thinking about all kinds of names. And uh, finally, in desperation, I just got the map down and looked around the Memphis area where I'm from down there. And, uh, and I came across Conway, Arkansas. Mm -hmm. And then I came across Twitty, Texas, and put them together. Put them together. And that's the way it's been for the last 33 years. Yeah. I, I like to think that there may be a young guy just starting out right now who wants to change his name and selects Harold Jenkins. <laughs> uh, and, yeah. and Twitty City, what is the deal on Twitty City? <laughs> that's, a, that's an actual place, right? Yeah. This is... Sure. Twitty City is yeah. a place. It's, it's, a, uh, it's right outside of Nashville. Mm -hmm. it's a, I, I want to say it's a tourist complex, but it's also my home. Mm -hmm. Uh, all, uh, the, 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 the heart and soul of Conway Twitty Enterprises is right there. Right there. You live there and people I also come there. to visit? I, I, yeah, we have people from all over the world yeah. come there. It's, I have it's the same kind of deal at my place in Connecticut. I heard about that. <laughs> yeah. Uh, we, uh, we'll, we'll have to be right back here. <laughs> That's it. We're out of time. Thanks, everybody. We'll see you tomorrow.